All right, time for another edition of d and December. I think this is my third d and December. The first one was Icewind Dale, and the last, and the second time was the first Baldur's Gate. So today, and throughout the month of December, is going to be Baldur's Gate 2. Now, like I said before in my previous streams, I'm not a D&D aficionado, so if I say anything that's not correct, let me know. I think we start with this. The Lord of Murder shall perish, but in his death he shall spawn a score of mortal progeny. Chaos shall be sown in their footsteps, so saith the wise Alando. spent your youth in the library fortress of Candlekeep under the kind tutelage of your foster father Orion. Oh yeah, this picks up where the first Baldur's Gate left off. A kindred spirit. Her background was as mysterious as your own. Orion's murder brought answers to your questions when his killer Saravok was revealed to be your brother. You Give all new meaning to sibling rivalry. A product of the time of troubles, a chaotic period when gods were made flesh and forced to walk the earth. One such deity foresaw his own death and walked the land before the cataclysm. He left a score of mortal offspring, intended to be the fuel for his rebirth. But nice God kid. was Bob, Lord of Murder, and you are one of his children. Saravak sought a war of sacrifice to prove his worth, believing he could become the new Lord of Murder. You killed your brother, sending his taint back to Bob. You were the hero of Baldur's Gate, but some suspected you shared the same lineage as Saravak. You departed soon after, under circumstances much darker than anyone would have believed. They came as you rested, figures cloaked in mist that clouded your thoughts, blurring the lines between consciousness and dreaming. There was no malice or hatred, no mention of an old score, only quick capture and the promise of grim deeds to come. Right, I have a lot of uh things to take care of, but we'll go here. Oh! Oh, I just realized. Right here. If I understand correctly, if you beat the first Baldur's Gate, I think whatever character you use comes with you. I did not think of that, but I think we're gonna make this a little more interesting, and we're just gonna do this instead. I like this one, she's like, mm. such a dopey face. Yeah, I think some of these I recognize from uh, the first game, but not very many of them. And there's the dude with the hamster. 
this guy. Ah, yes, there's that monk. And there's the, uh, ogre, I think? Well, anyways, um, oh no. This is the dude with the hamster. Nope. Well, never mind. I'm not gonna go into details. Well, there's a ton of these to choose from. I think we're just gonna choose this one. Of course, I'm gonna be a human, of course. Of course, I always like being fighters. And I'm just going to be a regular fighter. I'm always a lawful neutral. My character's not going to be much of a spellcaster. So I think I'm going to knock his intelligence back a bit. Let's give it a 12. Yeah, I'm going to make him a little bit more nimble than that. This looks pretty balanced. Let's see here. Hmm. Definitely gonna do this and this for sure. Now I'm not gonna have a master. Uh, I'm not gonna do a short and sword and shield style because my characters always have shields. You know what? I'm gonna give them two of each. my way, my character would not have any hair, but I digress. I mean, this looks good. To battle and victory! Let's do this quick and pain. Is that from Scooby-Doo? Is giving me an injector? Me. Because why not? Alright. Except. Wait, hang on. Let's create another party here. Now, the only thing I don't know is if we're going to come across more characters. I mean, I could do a solo play if I wanted to, but it's going to be <laughs> really, really, really hard. Um. Hmm. What? I'm going to stop here a minute. So I know in the first game... Someone tells me I'm... Okay, so it looks like there is. So, I think for the record here... I think I'm going to go alone. So. 
And if you think I'm going to do anything harder than this, you're out of your mind. Okay, so essentially it's not that much different from the first game. Ah, the child of Paul has awoken. It is time for more experiments. The pain will only be passing. You should survive the process. I always hate it when they say that. Interesting. You have much untapped power. your potential. More intruders have entered the complex, Master. They act sooner than we had anticipated. No matter, they will only prove a slight delay. He messed with your head too, huh? I'm, I'm an Imian. We live in the same place for years. I guess I can't blame you for forgetting. All I remember is us getting jumped near Baldur's Gate. It was quick. Oh yeah, I think she was in the first game. I don't think I want to remember it all. He's been doing things to us. We have to get out of here. Don't make me think of it. He did the same to you. I think I heard you screaming like it anyway. Was fighting, my cell was damaged. I don't know if I could get out again. The pain in my head is getting worse. You got any acetaminophen? It isn't like a normal pain. It's on the inside, like my bones made a little dagger and it won't go away. Don't look at me like that. It just hurts, alright? It must have been the noise. There was a fight. Assassins came after our captor, I think. There's people dead all over, and the fighting is still going on. I can hear. Are you going to get moving, or do I have to leave without you? Minsk and Jahir are just northeast of us, trapped in cells sort of like yours. We should free them and then find some gear. We should look in that room to the west first. West and just a bit north. I think I saw some weapons in there. It's a room off the corner of this one. I don't think it's our gear. They probably sold our best stuff, but anything is better than nothing. Now let's go! Oh, hold on, I just realized something else. Party AI on. Oh, that's right, now that I think of that. Um, I'm trying to think here. How did I do this before? Is it through here? No. these guys too. Yeah, we know. I'm trying to think here. How did I do this? Yep. Oh, she's a thief. All right. Um, 
My anger is under complete control. Complete. I will control it as I rip limb from limb. I will control it as I pound head after head. And I will control. No. No control. No mercy. I will avenge. Avenge. Dinah hair. Trapped. Her spirit. Her spirit is trapped in a cage created by my failure. I was to guard her, but she. She. They. They killed her as I watched. You see. I know not who they were, but but I will redeem myself. This, this is that is horrible. I am so sorry for you. I won't cry for the dead. I won't, okay? Maybe a little. But I will staunch the flow of tears with righteous fury. Lullaby and good night, evil. Minsk will make you pay. When you help me, we must join together once more, and our fury will be such that bars will run their quills dry. Yes, ink will be scarce where we go. I do not know either. The bars have no lock at all. They are smithed together. I am proud that they fear me enough to imprison me permanently. But you will keep looking, of course. You will never give up. I know this. A hero always succeeds, and a hero never stops short of his goal. You have brushed me aside with your words. You won't help. Boo can see it now. You do not intend to cut my chains. You only intend to yank them. I will make sure you do not live long enough to abandon more friends. I will. I will do all this as soon as I get these bars open. Right. The bars. They bend and twist with my berserker strength. Minsk and Boo are free. No, you will not. No. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, you are a smart one. I understand now. You said what you did just to get me mad. Mad enough to break free. <laughs> Smart as sometimes. This guy's a nut job. Now that we can resume our adventures together, there are friends to avenge and villains to smack about the face and neck. Right, Boo? Answer they will, and my sword shall be the question. We shall have fistfuls of sweet, sweet justice, and our enemies will be stains beneath our feet. But, yes, but, but, all right. Boo tells me that I am raving again. I did not notice a difference, but I shall heed his words nonetheless. If you have to take advice from a hamster, you've got something going on here, and I don't want any part of it. Come, we must go now. Yes, Minsk and Boo and you, together again. Beware, villains. I will force justice down your evil, evil throats. I am the best carnivore. I am large, and I carry nature's favor with me wherever I go. Who is my animal companion? And while some smaller rangers might compensate for their size by traveling with bears or wolves, I prefer the subtleties provided by a miniature giant space hamster. Yes, subtle. Really? I don't know about that, Mince, but he sure is a cute little fuzzy wuzzy, aren't you, Boo? Oh, brother. Boo is the best purchase I ever made, and despite my head wound, I could tell that his previous owner was good and honest. Boo is an asset to us all. I have lost myself in your words, but Boo thinks you're just ducky. Onward! Oh yeah, let's... Oh yeah, that's right, we start with absolutely nothing. So what's his story? I wonder if I can use Minsk... ...to get through small passages. Hmm. Maybe. I know none of us are spellcasters. Just trying to think. Quickly, we must get out of here before whoever did this returns. I swear, traveling with you is never dull. Refresh your. Perhaps you've taken a knock or two to the head. At the least, I would say that not remembering me is a symptom of some deeper problem. Though I would not rule out a bad attempt of humor on your part. No, we have traveled together too long for such games, and I will answer plain true if it will help. Jahir is what I am called, as you should know, well know. We have traveled together for some time, and the places we have gone um, are too many to name. I wonder if they're trying to recollect thoughts from the first game. 
At the behest of your slain foster father, my husband Khalid and I have an interest in you. Though you have proven to be your own person in all things, we remain in your company as friends more than guardians, and our exploits together have left the lands for the better. We have earned many enemies, but we have dispatched them all. Whoever has trapped us now is certainly powerful to have done this so easily. Once we know, we will deal with them in due course, but for the time being, it is more important we retrieve our friends and companions and leave this place. I do not know where he is, and it worries me. No doubt he was taken as we were, though it seems we were all meant for different fates. From the state of my head, I think I have been drugged, though I have been spared any serious physical mistreatment. You, however, look as though you have been treated most unfavorably, and I should not like to think of Kelly receiving the same. I don't know. If you are of sufficient strength, it is possible the cage may be broken. If not, you may have to search for whatever key it might need. Do try to hurry up. I wish to be out of here before the owner returns. The ease of our capture suggests it may be beyond our power to resist. It would be best to face the culprit another day on our own terms. So go and be quick. We must free ourselves soon. It must be done. Where Minsk goes, evil stands aside. Oh yeah, that's right. Now it's starting to come back to me. Now numbers go backwards. a relief and about time too we should get be going immediately not only might our host come back i simply must see the sun again in none too short a time this dank place stifles me this place is hard in your math i do not remember you being so quick with a calm remark you know as you wish but do try carefully will you that it's not hostile. I suppose this maker didn't expect us to escape, so it never got orders for restraining us. They only do exactly what they are directed to do. They don't really think. If it hadn't been told to keep quiet, we might get some information out of it. I am not permitted to speak with prisoners. Return to your cells. It is the master's wish. You are his prisoner. He has brought you to his home because he owns you now. You must return to your cell. It is the master's will.
Only I release the master's prisoners. You are his and must return to the cells. It is his wish. I am not bound to stop you. The guardian will stop you from leaving. Return to your cells. It is the master's wish. Are those last two sentences on autoplay or on a loop? You must not disobey the master. Return to your cells. I'm waiting. I'm willing. Yeah? Who's gonna stop me there, big guy? Hmm? I just wanna go this way first. Ooh. Oh, look at that. It's done. Buzzes with electrical energy. Hmm. My blade is down the path. Oh, did you? Oh, it's charmed now. Yeah, but unfortunately, he's not in the best shape. That's probably the door out of here. Alright, so I always get the highest armor, so... She can equip it. Not the Technically she could, but uh Oh she's a mage thief combo. Okay, let me let's review the other three characters. He's a ranger. She's a fighter druid. Hmm. I think this would be better for her because it doesn't affect the to hit armor condition zero as much as this does. So there's also the, uh, uh,
This room is dominated by mineral deposits and crystals. It seems to be a natural cavern that this strange prison has been built around. The air holds an aura of power, and several pools with swirling light grace the edge of the rough cavern. Hmm. Welcome, and you have escaped somewhat later than I had hoped. I am Ataka. You have my welcome to my little pieces of this place. I do try to keep you more appealing than the rest. Your name is well known amongst those who watch. Your life's thread is bright and deep, though in your path lies many a dark and great end. As to easing your mind and answering such questions as those that surely plague you, it is not my place to do. I am sorry. Such assistance as you will get from me depends on yourself. Are you prepared to answer a question? And here is my hypothetical question. You and your sibling are captured and locked in separate cells, unable to communicate. The major responsible appears and speaks. He explains his sadistic game. In each cell there is a magic button. If you press your button and your sibling does not, you will die, but your sibling is free. If your sibling presses the button and you will die, they will die, but you will go free. If neither of you nor your sibling press the buttons, both of you will die. If both of you press your respective buttons, both of you will die. The major says that you have one turn of the hourglasses. Decide your decision. Decide your action, then he leaves. This is silly. Buttons are not how one escapes dungeons. I would smash the button and rain be liberal. Down on the wizard for playing such a trick. Oh, verily. Of that I have no doubt, Mince, but the question is after that the present answer born on the wisdom of me, not your impatience. That answer will not suffice. Choose again. Interesting. No action can be performed without consequences, especially that which follows the noble path. Deal with this noble one. You can deal with the consequences of your actions in return for your indulgence. I offer advice. Seek out Relev. He waits for such as you. Offer him the release that he craves, and you shall still find the focus. Your journey shall soon become apparent. Farewell. What a weird dude. Well, she can use a shield, but her wizardry will be disabled, and we do need a magic caster, so... bullets. Good to go. Oh, what do we have here? A quarter staff.
kind of monster is this guy? Captures as easy as pie, kills whoever he wants. That could have been us in those glass things. I want to know what he did to me too. My head still hurts really bad. He said something about potential, about you too. I don't care if he could make us three ogres strong. I have to get out of this place. It bothers me. It makes me think I see things. servant born of the master's magic. He has designed me to clean the sewers and feed the guardian. I am not permitted to speak of him. It is, if it is not time to perform my duties, I must return to my rest. He feeds on the filth and remains of the prisoners. Okay, so I'm gonna lie to this guy. I have cleaned the sewage chambers and fed your guardian. Do you wish me to open the doors to the pit to begin my duties again? It is all that you have pissed and s okay, and sorceress me to do. You have not activated my movement functions. You must use the activation stone. Relev has the activation stone, Master. It is on the table in his room. The table is near. The table near his life support jar. As you will, Master. Boy, more items already. Huh. Okay, so we got a whole bunch of goodies here, but we can't identify any of these things here. Okay, I'll give her the scimitar. Good. Let's see here. Right, you are. Spell magic, huh? I know she knows how to dispel magic. All right, so now she's uh, right, she's a little more equipped. Wait, hold on. There's still other goods in here too. Neither the ladies can learn the bow and arrow. I'm kind of surprised. Well, anyways, um, let's continue. Well, what do we have here?
more golems. A golem stares straight ahead. It does not appear to see or hear you. You suspect that this golem is inactive. Same thing. Hmm. I wonder. Looks like we got more torture chambers. Uh, he was my friend, I think. Cast out, and one of us no longer. I cannot remember. Are you to take my place? It is difficult to remember. I was relive. Dead. has forgotten me, not killed me. I was faithful hound to the master, a friend even. I was dying or dead. I cannot remember which. Truly, you are a stranger to this place. Eternal life was to be my reward for faithful service. The master has suspended me until he can cure me, return my youth to me. I begin to understand. The master has left my side for study of another. He seeks to awaken power, a study of life and death, but I cannot bear the role of years. He has forgotten because he does not wish to remember what was taken. I barely remember myself. Release! Yes! Master! Uh, I no longer wish to come back! Let me slip into the oblivion that has been denied me. Please! This unit has me that contains me powered by cells by crystals take them when i can sleep die again die at last i know you are prisoner some things do not change you must escape this place and the master's experiments there are others like me but of more recent experiments they may know how the master exits the complex will you take these cells to revive them and learn what you can in return for this path to freedom i have offered ye Away. I have seen death in our scuffles before, but here I did nothing but watch his life end. I can't look away. Death is pretty. Why would I think that? Oh, you. I've got to get out of this place. Give me some direction. Alright, so I got the energy cells. Great. Got a buckler. Oh, 
But it'll be so nice to get rid of all this when uh everything is said and done. Make ourselves a little bit of money too. Oh, but I can't identify anything because I don't think. Oh, she can identify things. All right, well. Okay then, have at it. Oh. Oh, that's how you can only identify one. One coal damage, huh? Oof. I think I'm gonna take this over this. Alright, let's... I'm very surprised, like I said before, she can't use a bow and arrow. I'm very surprised. Unless she can't. It's done. I mean, she has a fighter primary and a druid secondary. But, heck do I know. Base here. And of course, we might have to leave some items behind too, so yeah. Okay, so it looks like we have to find a switch, since apparently we can't get out this way. choice but to uh go back to here wait unless okay never mind I can't go 
I forgot about this. I'll give her the bow instead. Why? Well, because it just works that way. Just so long as I can call it home. What is it? Hold on. I'm waiting. I'm there. Right. Let's go. Another one of these kind of doors. This way, then? Yeah, it is. Must be done.
is probably best left to me. Here. Miss Timber, far enough without you bothering me. Suffice to say, this place is your doom. By the time the master returns, we shall be dead and we shall be rewarded. Adam, lads, no mercy. I guess, so I'm not surprised that you will be working for our captor. I doubt he cares for anything more than the quality of the knives they make. He has a lot of them. I'm going to have scars from this. Looks like you will too. As if I need another reminder, I don't care what power this guy thinks he can tap in you. He's just sick to the core. We can't ever look back. Should be getting close to leveling up at some point. Oh, yeah, I gotta remember to tread lightly. I'm not gonna go in there as of yet.
point, I punch. I think that could be too far away from only like. Give me some if it must be done. Master, master, is that you? I can barely see. It's been so long. I've been so alone. All alone. I did not mean to go to the master's room. I knew it was dangerous. So very dangerous in there. I was not trying to steal anything, truly. I was not trying to steal anything of the mistresses. I would never do that. I am faithful to you always. Why am I here, master? What has happened to me? Was I hurt in the mistress's room, master? I can remember nothing. Is the mistress's room truly so deadly? I am sorry. So sorry. Never do it again, master. Please save me. Please. I am so sorry, master. I will never do it again. I serve only you. Live by the sword. Live a good long time. So long have I lain behind this prison of glass. Do I weep and rage? I have called out so many, many times to thee, Master. Master, why hast thou forsaken me? Why hast thou left me in this battle to wither? Why? Master, thou didst place me here out of kindness, but thou hast forgotten me. If I simply slip from my thoughts, Master, please hear me. Thou couldst not cure what was done, but surely thy magics have increased, Master. Thou didst care for me once. Let me help you in thy search. Do not forget me here, Master, please. Why hast thou forgotten? This is no boon, Master. Please do not leave me. Ah, glass and thoughts for eternity, pain and loneliness for a destiny. I would hate being forgotten a bottle. It might depend somewhat on the type of bottle, but overall I expect the effect would be similar. It is not right. Why, Master? I only long to hear thy words once more. Why? Why? I'm kind of surprised that uh, Minskir isn't going to punch these jars. It's probably best left to me. Let's take a look at this one over here. Let's see what we can get out of it. Yeah, the light, ages of weariness, ages of burning. My master, I beg of you. It is burning me. My skin is a fire with the crawling of ants. Oh, please, master, save me. I am not like your genie to be caught within a bottle for, for, ah. Please, please, master, the ants. Does your genie have nothing of yours that may aid me? Ah, I, I will take the statue and speak to him myself. If you will, but let me. Please give me the statue, Master. Ah, uh, the pain crawls along my skin. Aid me, Master. The genie must have magic, must have something. Oh, please, the pain. Ah, ah the burning. It is monstrous that one would do such a thing to a servant, to lock him away in an eternity of pain. It offends nature. Master, you must hurry. The prisoner will break soon, and you will have the answers that you seek. No, Master, I have not had the golem open the cells. He has no key. I beg your forgiveness, Master. But did you not leave the cell key at the table in the jailer's room? Thank you, Master. I shall return to the prison. Yeah, we are ready to care of that. Okay, so I must have overlooked it. it. Must be over there. This is worth it. Is 
There it is. Alright, perfect. Let's go back to the, uh... Let's go back to that golem and let's get him to open the doors and let's get out of here. something here. Oh my god, I don't think we can do it just yet. Go. What in the world? slowed. I can't say for certain. It's probably Good to go. He is poisoned. I don't have any antidotes. potion. Okay, so I think we're set to go. Wait, we're missing someone. Just wait for them to catch up. <sighs> I always hate waiting for that one individual. What is it?
see to it. Right you are. Yeah, it's done. So we have to go into this room now. So who's slowing down here? She is. Can we get out of here? <laughs> nope. I'll say to it. So Alright, let's go. What is it? No problem at all. Hmm. There's a clue here. What did it say? The door is no longer. This place is just too darn creepy. However, the floor has an odd really shaped recess in it. It looks as if a central figurine could fit within. Hmm. Really? The floor, you say? Hmm. Okay, so let's go find this. Figuring your statuette. Oh, 
was nothing back here. You can count on me. Oh. Nothing of value. if the energy cell has something to do with it. I gotta go back to the sewage golem and see if he can do something about it. Hmm. No, he already unlocked all the other doors. Maybe we have to go here again. Because there might be something I might have missed. There's damage all three chests. And yet... Oh, there's this door, too. Oh, I forgot all about it. Well, what do you know? see much use for the sling for this character, so I'm not going to bother. I'm there. So this must be the bedroom. You suddenly have a sense of imminent danger. Something here is not what it seems. Hmm. 
wondering that Then again, we're probably going to start dropping some of these weapons too, because they really don't serve much of a purpose. This will suffice for now. Let's go talk to Lean. Protect me. Yes, help us. Free us. We are his possessions, his servants, his concubines. Please help us escape. If you can escape, you must take our acorns to the queen. Tell her our plight in this creature's lair. Take them to the fairy queen who lives in the south end of the Windspear Hills. This will be our deliverance from this... This errant... Erinesis up in his dungeon. So, I see we have a name for our captor at last. Erinesis, is it? Tell me, Dryas. Why is this Erinesis who go to such lengths to keep you three here? We are supposed to instill emotion, but he is barren inside. I am not sure what he expects. Well, his plans for us at least. If you take the acorns to the fairy queen, then she can regrow our trees and free us. We cannot leave our trees. If we are separate from trees, we will die. Our trees will die too. Thank you. We must take the acorns and deliver them to the fairy queen on the south end of the Windspear Hills. But he has taken the acorns. He knows of our plans. It amuses him. 
He has left a right with Illich. Illich is mean. Illich is the clan chief of the master's Drugar slaves. He is somewhere within the dungeon. Return to us when you have the acorns, and we will tell you how to escape. So beautiful. I used to dream of dryads and their beautiful dreams. You are welcome among us, girl. Youthful exuberance is music we have not heard in such a long time. I used to dream, but he doesn't. Your charms don't work on him anymore, do they? How do you know this? He has touched you as us, hasn't he? Weird. Irenaeus searches for something he cannot find, and he looks within those that have no more idea than he. Irenaeus. A name that is synonymous with, with death and ugliness. No, death sounds different. He's shown me. I spit on his name. I spit on this place. Live as where you, live as you can where you must, young woman. You will not survive if you give in. We have learned this. I have learned something different. So beautiful you are. I almost can't see you. I just want to go home. When can we go home? You have done a noble thing for us. Please take these acorns to the fairy queen who lives in the south end of the Windspear Hills. We will help you escape. You must use the portals to travel up to the next level of the complex. This is how Aranisius travels. These portals are triggered by a certain key. He uses her key. He still loves her, you see. He keeps her room just as it was, though well protected. We go there sometimes and look at her things. May the forest always open a path for you. He would, he would speak to them while, while he, it's for a lost love, kept in perfect condition. She, she despises him. This is his monument to her. He spoke all of this, but, but his voice was cold. No emotion at all, not even remembered. He spoke of these things even while he cut, he cut, and the spells that wove through my brain called ugly things. It still hurts. His sick fingers are still in my head, doing whatever it was he started. I see blood and death behind his eyes. Irenaeus. This room, if he could care for anything, he would care for this room above the lives of all of us. It makes me sick. I feel. I feel so much hate. I would burn this place, but it is nothing. Even if it means so much, it is nothing. Let's do what we must and get out of this place. It's making me sick. Give me some direction. Take something to stall the pain. Just like old time. Jesus Christ. Okay, that should sell the poison for a little while. Jesus Christ, what's with all these traps? The sanctity of the mistress's room has been violated. The intruder will die.
Lucy, why aren't you using your spells? You're using your, uh... Your master thievery. Ooh. Can we all please quit fighting over the door? is gone, and you managed to get yourselves in trouble. That I would, Manling. I assume that now that you have escaped, you have come seeking the magical item that has been stripped from you by our collective captor. I do. A thing of power that still carries a hint of your essence. There is nothing, there is something odd about the signature that you leave on this item, no matter. If I had the power to give you your weapon, I would, but the force that binds me is strong. As long as I am trapped within this glass, I am within the mage's power. If you consider the means of my release, I will give you your weapon. 
This flask that I have found is in a creation of magic. It is unbreakable as long as it remains apart from its twin, the real flask. You must find the original flask and bring it back to me. Once within the, once it is within my grasp, I can break the enchantment and be freed. He will keep the clasp close to himself. The master would not risk it falling into others' hands. Perhaps he keeps it in his chambers, or with his dried concubines. Perhaps the golems have it. I cannot pinpoint its location from another plane. You shall have to search for it. Return to me when you have found it, and we shall exchange my freedom for your weapon. Yeah, it's probably best left to me. Hmm. So it's gotta be in the chambers, or... It's gotta be one of the chambers, or... Alright, so... Let's start... Not, not on his golems, I would've... If that was the case, I would've had it already. Not a concern. You can always ask the concubines. Or maybe it's in the portal over here. I don't know, it's very hard to say. These three about the flask. You are very noble to risk your own safety. To free the genie, we have the flask and shall give it to you. Well, thanks. I'll see to it. That was painless. Let us make the exchange. At last, I am free! Here is your item, Fleshling. You are an honorable person, and I feel that I must warn you. Keep away from the master. He will torch you for escaping and kill you for freeing his genie slave. Escape from his lair quickly if you value your life. Farewell. Sort of cast doesn't do me any good. But now he has no shield. I'm there. 
Alright, well that's sad and done. Let's move on to bigger and better things now. Yes? Step is over here. Not a concern. Well, I probably should rest up. of some kind, huh? Like I said, there's got to be something else I'm missing here. There just has to be. Supposedly a great adventurer. It's funny. We lived with him for years, and Shahira seems to know more about him. Nonsense. He was secretive with everyone. We just had mutual acquaintances. I guess he was a big friend of the Harpers. He even got a visit from Cleveland Blackstaff once. A real powerful mage talked to Gorion like an equal. I wish we could go back to those days before all this fuss and bother, before I learned, well, we've seen so much. Candle keeps seems so small now. Funny. I was sorry to go, but I couldn't let you wander off on your own. Now, could I? After Gorion died, you needed all the help you could get. Not that I'm much help right now. My head still aches and I keep seeing things. Too much death around here, everywhere. It's in everything, even me. You won't be able to just walk away, you know. The guy that captured us, he knows about you. He says something about potential, something about great power. Say we won't look back. I don't care if you can we'll tap the power access, whatever avatar stuff. We gotta get away from all this death. It means a lot to hear that. I can't stand all these shadows. Yeah. Alright, so there has to be some way out of here. Like, 
I'm missing a key or something. Almost really the equalizer. I wonder if there's a key of fire that we're missing. Right. Could imagine. I mean, after all, we got the key of lightning, a key of cold, so I can only imagine there's got to be a key of fire somewhere. I mean, it just makes sense. Like I said, there has to be a key, a wand of fire somewhere. Wand of lightning key. I wonder if she can use it. so far, but boy, there's always something missing. Just don't know what. I hate to break it to him, but I already killed the, uh, Guardian. I'm there. Oh, what's this over here? I don't, oh, there's another door. I feel like an idiot right now. somewhere but where maybe back in here per se I 
find out that two of my characters are, uh... <sighs> okay, so we found two teleport portals, but there's a third. I mean, after all, it would just make more sense. They have three, right? There's one more key. Does that mean I just need to, uh... I just need to figure out exactly... to do this, but I have never done this before. Portal keys in the mistress's room? Oh. <laughs> That's the weird thing, is that I could have sworn I went in there and yet, it's absolutely nothing. Huh. <sighs> the problem is, I don't know where it is. Unless I have it already. I don't know that. Okay. 
Okay, that explains why. Here it is. All right. I have no antidote potion, so I'm gonna tread lightly. <sighs> oh, I have it. Good to go. character doing? Idiot. I'm not do anything else, but we're gonna sleep here. Sleep in the master's bedroom. <laughs> now I'll keep the stream going for a little while longer until I make some progress. by servants of the wizard themselves. We have been in prison and worse, and given many reasons to distrust strangers we encounter. I share your sentiments. I have seen much here that disturbed me. I, myself, am a warrior with no evil intentions. Please, I welcome any assistance you might offer. How did you come to here? It is, it is actually quite, a uh, embarrassing. My profession does not leave itself open to those who are not worried, yet somehow I was caught unaware. I came to Atkatla years ago from Carater to seek my fortune. At some point, I went to bed in my room at the copper corner net, and I woke in a strange room with a very sore head. I do not know how long I was here before awakening. I am unsure. I may have been drugged when I was brought here. I may have been unconscious. Either way, I do not know how long. If it was the former, this place could be anywhere. If it was the latter, then I don't imagine that I could have traveled very far without noticing. And you do know the hardship of being sent into a maze like a helpless hamster. We are comrades in peril. Who asks what you propose we do next, little man? I do not know a way to escape this place. Perhaps we should search for a section. Blech. I do not know a way to escape this place. Perhaps we should. We could search for this place together. Exit for this. Never mind. What do you need to know? I do not know a way to escape this place. I shall be happy to lend my blade to your cause. There are two things that I have discovered about this place that may help us escape. In the next chamber beyond the one in which we stand, four portals lie. Each of these portals release a little crackling fiend which tries to kill me. These little beasties keep coming in through the portals. Perhaps if the portals are destroyed, one could defeat the beasts that have already come through. Shortly beyond that chamber, there is a hallway that contains several wands mounted in pedestals. They bless all that walk before them. I notice that each wand is locked into the pedestal and can be removed if one had the proper key. I don't know where these keys are. Let us begin. Alright, um, let's see, I'm gonna make a... Alright, so it looks like there is an auto save here. But I'm gonna make a manual save for this. We're gonna call this... That. Alright. I think on that note here, um... I think on that note here, we're gonna stop. Uh, thank you to those who watched. I'll see everyone next time.